She just want pop molly and pop zannies and prescriptions I used to play my song, nobody ever wanna listen Now I got so lit and enter fuego all they mention I been in the club, I'm popping bottles, get attention Yeah, I used to hate my smile, now I want your skylight, like love my dance. I been playing with my racks and now I do not play no tennis Hop up in my bands, I swear to God that shit not ready I been living life like I don't care what I been spending What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Yama from The Common Hype. Back again, another video. You guys know, we're, we're back on schedule now. Bryson's got the camera set up, he's got the PC set up, we're back. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to like this video. Leave a comment down below because we respond to every single comment. We've not missed a single comment and we respond quick, all right? So if you guys wanna comment back, chop it up with us, make sure to leave a comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you have not already. We're on the road to 100,000 subscribers. We're about to hit 50 here pretty soon. So thank you guys for all the love and support that you guys have shown. Remember, we give away $25 cash app, right? directly into your account to every single video to a random comment. All you gotta do is throw a comment down below. If we choose you, we'll pay you out. Here's the last guy we paid from the last video just to show you guys that yes, we actually do pay out the 25 bucks. So be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and let's get into today's video. First box we got right here is actually I think some sports cards. If you guys aren't already, be sure to follow our card page at Common Breaks where we teach you guys everything about cards. Full pack, select mega boxes right here sell them a lot we need them bang also i do want to mention we've moved all of our card stuff outside the store and we've moved it to that card page so we actually don't sell sports cards in store anymore just because again the instagram has kind of taken over if you guys are looking for sports cards or anything be sure to go check out that page over there got another package right here this is from the homie connor shout out good chefs he's a good chef member sent me a pair of dunks mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All it needs to be said. Wow. Syracuse high dunks and a six and a half wide. Ladies. Ladies. If you need them, we got them. Got another package from Shane right here. Again, you guys are new to the channel? We buy off you guys all the time. All you gotta do is negotiate a deal with us via email or Instagram DM, preferably email, because we go through emails a lot more. Leave the agreed total on a piece of paper in the nuts and then we pay you out. If you guys don't leave a note, we're not gonna pay you out and it could take one or two weeks. So please always leave a note with your payout information. Otherwise it's gonna take a while for us to pay you out because then we gotta backtrack on our end. We have some, ooh, 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 ooh. Wow, not your favorite size though. Not my favorite size, but I think a size that we can move since it is in that colorway. Got a pair of vast gray highs as well. Nine women in the Crimson High, and a pair of UNLV Dunks right here. And then this package right here. My homie, again, who is also a Good Chefs member, hit me up and said, I got a pack for you. I said, say less. And it's a pack of uh, a bunch of stuff. And the Ash Pearls, <laughs> okay? Got a pair of Ionite, size 11 and a half in there. Ash Pearls from 12, 12 and a half, and 13. And then in this box as well, I think we're gonna see a lot of different stuff in here. He's actually supposed to be sending me a bunch of other stuff, but he never sent it through quite yet. I don't know what the hype is behind these things, but they go for a check, like an absolute check. I think these go for like four or 500 for whatever reason. So I got a pair of those. We have some 700 creams in here. We have more kyanites, more ash pearls. And this shoe, is it a bad colorway? It's all right, to say the least. All right, so one of the packages we just opened, I was a little confused about because I was wondering why we paid so high on a pair of shoes. And we closed this deal on June 23rd and he shipped it to us, it just got here today. Price looked a little funky when we got it. So I me and Brandon kind of checked back on when this deal happened and it was over email. I checked the, the timestamp, it was a little over three weeks ago. We agreed to 140 a pair. We, Brandon off the top of his head knew market was about 110. So we, we bought a pair in store yesterday. Yeah, we bought a pair in store yesterday, a 7Y, and we paid 100, 110, whatever. The longest short of it yeah, is, the, is oh, if we agree to a deal, don't take three weeks to ship because that's, that's, that's BS. Yeah. The that. shipping label is seven days after we agreed to the deal. So for that type of deal, we, I mean, we can't honor that just because it's not fair to us. So know? going forward, just keep in mind, like if we make a deal, we want that deal shipped out within 24 hours. And in our hands within three to five business days. I know UPS and USPS are backed up, but and it's not so much. It's not even about the price. Like if the yeah. guy shipped it same day and obviously market tank, we obviously yeah, we'll honor that. Just like if a shoe goes up, we want you to honor the deal even if it goes up. Correct. And vice versa. But if it's taking you three weeks to ship it, it's that's that's kind of messed up. So, anyways, we gotta reach out back to this guy. But the other pickups we did make, we're gonna put into our system, make sure they're all legit, and then pay the guy out. So. And where can they shop all those shoes, Brandon? CommonHypeAZ.com twenty five eight. And where can they see us? 
1342 West Warner Road, Monday through Saturday, 12 to 7. Sunday, 12, 12 to, to 5. 5. Give him a fit check while you're on the hot oh, streak. Oh, gosh. College Navy's on. Haven't wore these a lot. I don't have a lot of fits to match them, so, you know, whatever. The, the blue Lulus and then the... Let's go, man. Shout out to my boy. Shout out to my girl. Sold the crown for, you know, little Patriots vintage pickup. So, wow. it's not the tea I want to be seen in, but... We've got me and Drew here. Oh, we've been working all hard today. Uh, we've been doing a lot of stuff on the back end today. Um, Drew's been kind of running the floor. Me, Tommy, and Brandon have been in the back. Um, Drew's been kind of jumping back and forth, and we've just been working on a lot of designs for clothing that we're going to be doing here. We don't want to call it merch because we, we want to separate the store, and we don't want to have, like, the classic merch. We want to have a brand behind it. We want to have stuff that you guys would actually wear, and we want to make stuff that we would actually wear. So we're putting a lot of time in the designs that we're doing. Brandon's mentioned the shorts. Um, those are getting worked on right now, but mainly we're focusing on our t-shirt designs. Obviously summer, you gotta have a nice tee. Why not? You gotta have, like, such as this. Fit check me real quick before I get in on them. Rookie of the years, um, some vintage Carhartt shorts, and then the vintage Bulls tee. Wow. What's Had to the, do it today. Where's the black color hat? Yeah. Switched out for the Uniform Studios hat today. Um, but anyway, here are a couple samples that we had made. Let us know what you guys think down below. We have a lot more samples uh, getting made right now. We have a lot of designs getting worked on right now, but these are just the first samples that we physically had in hand. So we have a black and a white version right here, and then we got a hit on the back. So we kept the old English font, similar to the one that we used on the hats, but a little bit different, obviously, as you guys can see. So let us know what you guys think down below. Um, again, these are just samples. It's not to say we are or not gonna drop them, but we wanna see how you guys like them down below. So we wanna have some exclusivity to these drops. Um, and again, just create stuff that you guys are really like. Maybe a different color hat. Maybe a different color hat. Maybe Who a couple knows? different colors. Yeah, so we have a lot of stuff getting worked on. Again, the hats, the, sh the shirts, uh, the shorts. Um, I'm already working on some hoodie designs for the winter. Obviously, we're not there yet, but we're going to get there at some point. We want to make sure we have stuff going for you guys. We're going to be on some scheduled stuff and just give you guys a lot more of the information going forward. But again, don't want to talk too much about it before it's done. Don't want to get ahead of ourselves. Just trying to focus on what we're dealing with right now. Um, and yeah, let us know what you guys think about those tees. Again, just samples, but we want to know what you guys think about them. So the homie Ryan came through and sold us a bunch of Yeezy slides and some 450s. I don't think we ever showed the 450s on camera, so I just want to show you guys these real quick. Apparently, they're really comfortable. You like them? Not really. Anyways, Ryan started reselling when he was 13 years old and has now got to a point where he can resell and do a bunch of stuff like this. So any advice for all the young kids out here watching the videos who always love supporting everything any advice that you have for them in terms of you started when you were younger and now getting to the point where you got any advice you have for them just reselling uh honestly just join a cook group uh get involved with your cook group like make sure you're actively like asking questions and like you know learning about bots and proxies and servers and all that stuff keep good business relations with your book buyers like brandon I mean, that's really it. Like, honestly, just connect with people and uh, learn how to bot. That's basically it. Again, Yeezy slides right here, in case we didn't already see the colorway. This orange colorway right here, which they made a size 7 and actually a size 5, apparently, for whatever reason. But thank you again for selling us the Paris. Yes, sir. Nice little big cash out deal. What are you going to do with that money, huh? Buy yourself something. You already bought some UNC dunks. Yeah. We'll see. Buy yourself something nice, okay? Yeah. You know, Chick fil A on me. Yeah. <laughs> here it is. Shake my hand. Pleasure doing business Pleasure with you. Business. So right now we're headed to Hassan's place actually because I owe him some shoes and I, not gonna lie, I kind of forgot to put them in the deal so now we're dropping them off. So we're going to Arizona Mills, going to grab some local style grinds. If you guys don't know, Fire Ass Hawaiian place here in Arizona and they just opened a spot right next to us so that's dangerous. But let's go ahead and drop off these pairs. We just pulled up to future reference, the store itself. But Hassan's not here. So now we're going to FaceTime him and we're going to pretend like he just got robbed. Say, can I call you later? No, just make no. Bro, say no. Just say, type all caps, emergency. <laughs> it's so funny because this guy's always like, give me an hour. Give me an hour. He wants to order stuff. Like give me I an hour. An hour. Like, I don't have an hour either. We're finally at Loco. And uh, she's, she's, she's always showing love. Not only does she whip it up in the kitchen. The go. She whips it up on the toe. Okay. Because okay? she buys so many shoes from us. In fact, she, she, she doesn't buy enough sometimes. And yeah. hey, you work hard, you deserve it. I work hard. <laughs> she does work hard. Yeah, yeah, work hard, play hard, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, exactly. Look what she's whipping up. You got the teriyaki. Oh, the action. The white rice. The action sauce. Action sauce for all that. Shout them out, local. Local style grinds. Arizona Mills Mall and in the Phoenix area. If you guys are ever in Arizona, you got to try this place. Boy Hanano, the man himself, is in the building. He also goes by H. You guys got to come through to local. Say, where's the show? Give us a peek at one of the places. Wow. Rice. 
the chicken, the mac. Action the sauce. Yeah, we're in downtown Phoenix off of 16th Street in Roosevelt. And then we're here at the mall at Arizona Mills. Arizona Mills. <laughs> I'm here at the mall at Arizona Hi. Well, boys, girls, ladies. Ladies. You are now seeing what goes on after hours. You asked for it. You asked for it, and this is it. We're living in luxury, baby. <laughs> at Drew's parents' house. Shake my hand. You know, and speaking of houses, the three Stooges over here are... Moving in. Moving in together. As of next week, week and a half or so, we will all be living under the same roof. And I'm so excited because the amount of stuff we are going to film... In that house. In that house, with all of us together. What can I say? We'll be watching movies, we'll be filming movies. The people want to see our personal collections once we're moved in. It's not big enough. I have to take it to uh, get cleaned first. So we're watching the Suns game right now, as you guys can see. We're copyrighted, so please turn to the camera. Thank you. But yeah, this is what kind of goes on after hours. We come back, we chill. Uh, in regards to earlier today, I wanted to mention something about the young resellers out there. When we cashed out that deal earlier today, again, that guy was young. He was 14, 15, 16, 17 years old. And I know a lot of you guys that age who watch the channel. So for those of you who are that age and want to get into reselling, that's all you got to do. Buy low, sell higher, rinse and repeat. Never. Sometimes hold you buy high, and sell, you sell low, even higher. Oh, oh. Buy high, sell low. Oh yeah. Why we make money when you can yeah. lose it? Why make money? Coming soon. Coming soon. But it all comes down like if you grind your ass off with everything, like everything pays off always. So and again, running a store. Everybody thinks running a store you just make millions of dollars, and it's every penny that we make goes right back into the business. As you guys know, Bryson just bought a seventy-five hundred dollar PC, plus a twenty-five hundred dollar laptop, plus a eight thousand dollar brand new camera. All of that's going right back into the store. We buy so many shoes. Bro. I don't pay myself some, some months. Actually, most months I don't even pay myself. I don't even get paid. All your money goes to Old Town. Yeah, yeah. We, we know. Yeah, we know where your money goes. But I, I mean, to an extent, though, Drew, when he goes out and he quote unquote networks. Well, he owns the store. That's right. <laughs> oh, I haven't told him that. Oh, I'll tell save that for another time. Invest everything back into the business, okay? Because at that the end of the easy. day, you're building equity in your company. You're building a brand around your company. And once that equity has been built and your brand is now one of the top tiers, like again, we're trying to be like the new urban necessities. We're trying to get like to where StockX and Go are and trying to create that online presence with like a bunch of these stores do, but we can't do that if you don't grind your ass off right now. So yeah, that's my little speech of after, during after hours. I need my shit check. I read, I respond to every single, cause we respond to every single comment i respond to a lot of them on um, the first 24 hours of the video you guys love my fits so i'll give you the quick fit check wow wow we got the fire reds on today hot cake wow. of the century right here uh the dior shorts club fantasy team the back goes pretty hard and a booker for three boys we're gonna watch the game we can't show it obviously because of copyright but uh maybe a little halftime break oh halftime little break. q a halftime break yeah Ooh. you guys should be watching the games because we're gonna we're gonna try and film every time we watch the game so make sure you guys are watching the games so you guys know what we're talking about all right so listen we kind of missed the halftime um breakdown full analysis you know we kind of talked amongst ourselves and then ended up uh forgetting to film it <laughs> you know, we were caught up in the moment suns were up suns were hot all game obviously you guys saw the suns won two zero we're up in the series, you know. I'm hoping we come back home and close it out because I'm trying to go to game five. Brian, are you going to try to go to game five with me? Or yeah, what? I mean, I might have to sell one of my new laptops. Yeah, I was, was going to say, you might have to sell the PC or the laptop or the camera or yeah. the other 18 things you just bought. <laughs> but anyway, we all saw what happened. We don't really need to talk about it. A lot of people in the comments are commenting, go Sun, Suns in four, so we'll see. But today, it's Friday in the shop. I got one package to unbox, and Brian's got a nice little package over here to unbox. So, you know, just a little content for you guys. No, dude, why? No way. You guys in the packing peanuts, listen. Bright accidentally deleted the clip last time I did packing peanuts. It was pretty funny, but. It's not funny today. It's not funny at all, actually. <laughs> Any, yesterday, today, tomorrow, it's not gonna be funny. <laughs> so if you guys are trying to do this as a joke, it's not funny. Yeah, good good one. Good one, haha. <laughs> you know what? Should we leave that for Bean to clean up? Yeah, I'm gonna leave it for Bean just so when he, just when he comes in next week to clean up. All right, so after all that, red box. Oh, from our boy Wear Supply. Thanks, Wear Supply. Maybe get some bubble wrap? Yeah. Wow. You guys haven't seen this one in a while. 11 and a half dead stock pair of Syracuse Dunks. Lows. Lows, not the highs. Not the highs. Not the hot cake highs, the lows. That's crazy, so. Shout out Wear Supply for the dead stock heat. Uh, Turn over to Bry for the next one. Can I check real quick? Oh, all right, all right. If you say so, twist oh, my right. arm. <laughs>
The black and white dunks, you guys know. You know, whatever. High white socks. That's the bry. Got the San Francisco Bravest Studios on. Got the black tee, but we'll, you know, see what's on the back. I know he likes the guys. The night addict. Yeah, it says night addict. It should say networking addict, but you know, it says night addict. <laughs> right, same thing. And then you know what I got on the cream and black comma hype hat. And you know, I got the chains on today. It's all right. Something light for the Friday. It's something light. All right, Brian, turn around. Let's see the fit. Like you said, it's Friday. It's light in here. I got the uh, LA fitted on. Explain this to me, boys, because I don't understand it. The, the whole thing where you keep the stickers on. Yeah, I don't get it. With, especially like this one I kept on. I mean, you might as well take it off, it's falling yeah. off. But the size tag? Mm -mm. Help me, help me, help me understand. I don't get the size tag thing. Anyway, Harley Davidson vintage tee, the Fear God NBA shorts, and like Drew said, we keep it light. It doesn't have to be the Jordans. It doesn't have to be the Dunks every day. You guys know I got the pretty heavy Vans collection, so just one with the classic orange pair today. All right, real quick, just a quick pause from the unboxings. Our boys came through, what's your guys' names? Luis, Chris. Luis and Chris came through, brought us some gems today. My size. Oh, God. Yeah. The off white fives. Stop. Our size. That's wow. Your size. Yeah. He's You're right. 8 through 11. Yeah. See? Exactly. He gets it. Seven and a half through 13. I guess. That's all I like to say. But yeah. The off white sale fives right here. Looks like brand new. Yep. Size 10. You guys know how broke I am after buying all my computers and PCs just the last couple weeks, but wow. Also our size. No. That's crazy. <laughs> the barely green dunks right here. Size 11 women, nine and a half men. Might be a little snug. Well, that's all right. Uh, looks like we got a pair of the waffle surprise. Yep, brand new. I mean, typically you say no, no, but you know, we're just talking about the Suns. No. Maybe. I haven't been picking up too many of the Sakai's, not gonna lie. Size nine and a half. Why'd you guys, why'd you guys have yeah. to come do it to us? Listen, it's uh, not payday today. Yeah, the Love Letter uh, Air Forces, those look brand new as well. Mm. Might have to talk some numbers on these. Got the bread right here. Same thing. And then another size nine and a half bread. Uh oh. Oh no. I know you. I know. I oh know. god. He just brought them to taunt us. Uh, do you have prices in mind for me of this? Um, I was thinking 420 for breads, but I'm flexible. Sales 378, 379, 387. Should do 390. I, I wouldn't be that high. I think my lowest is 380. Okay, I'll pass on those. No worries. What are you looking at on these? Um, what's the market right now? Market is 160. I could do that. Probably be at like 140 on these. 150? 140. Coin flip? <laughs> <laughs> you know yeah. about the coin flips. Yeah, not the coin flip on that. We'll get back to that one. Okay, so Kai's I'm probably okay on. They just don't move well for us. Uh, barely greens. Mm, was looking at around 210. Uh, market on these is like 150 to 170. Last sale was 150. Would you guys do 180? I'd probably be at the 150, which is highest bid. Lowest ask is 170. I could do that. Okay, do 150. Need and those. the sales size 10. What were you looking at? 630. I wouldn't pay. I wouldn't pay full market on these. 600. Would you be at 580? 580 cash, 150 cash, and then 140 cash. 870? Should do 880? I'd be firm at all those numbers because I'm already paying basically market on these. We could do 870. Okay. Let's do it, let's do it. All right. Yeah, Quick little cash out. You know me and Drew, we hold it down. All right. There it is, boys. Wide Oreo 4s, absolute yeah. banger. Still looking for my size. Uh, my boy Steven, you guys know sold out Steve from the Kobe Swap Me video. Um, he sold me a nine and a half, but I need a 10. So so on the lookout for a 10 if anyone watching, you need a nine and a half and you have a 10, let me know. I'd love to do a little size swap with you. Looks like we've got a pair of laser oranges. Wow, first pair. Size seven women, or size seven, yeah. Size seven women, five and a half men. Uh, didn't know I bought these, but here they are. <laughs> Drew really likes these, Brandon really likes these. And then, looks like I got a pair of Yeezy slides. That's true. Size six. How you doing? In the resin colorway right here, so. Light little packaging today. Um, gonna close out this video. That box is for Brandon. Um, pretty sure it's going right back out, so we're not gonna open it. And uh, yeah, let's see what else we got today. Listen, first, I can't make it up that happens in here. Sorry for cussing, whatever. Two, I. I wish I could have a camera on Brayden 24-7 <laughs> just for the stuff he says. I don't think you guys, yesterday, 
Well, we try to record what? so much stuff that yeah. can't not can't be filmed in the house because Bryson just doesn't film it. He's like, oh, I gotta get the camera out. Yeah. Like if you had the camera on us twenty four seven, this we would be at a million subscribers purely on the fact whoa, whoa, whoa. that, or we would be in jail. So <laughs> the second thing in the last twenty four hours that Brandon has said that is just purely shocking. That we've heard. That we've heard. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what he thinks in his head. <laughs> I don't really want to know what goes on up there. <laughs> so yesterday, as you guys know, we announced we're going to Kobe Swap Meet. Brandon asked me when he's writing down on the calendar. He goes, is it SWAT or SWAP with a T, the P or T? I was like, Brandon, I don't think we're going to a police convention. It's not SWAT. It's Kobe Swap Me. Because, you know, at the convention, people swap, people buy, purchase, sell. So then we're sitting here, we're talking about the office. As you guys know, we talked about it probably a million times now. And I can't wait for you guys to see what's going to happen. He goes, I'm going to need a third monitor. And I was like, oh, which one are you looking at? He goes, oh, I'm, I need a vertical monitor. He's like, if you can find me a vertical monitor, I'll pay. I'll pay the I'll pay high. pay the high for a vertical monitor. Tell him what you said, Tommy. Just, just a regular monitor flip, man. <laughs> I, I don't know if you, if you guys can maybe throw me a link in the comments, maybe DM me a link where there's a vertical monitor that exists. Everybody DM Brandon links. Yeah, the DM, yeah, oh. DM him links of monitors. Flood his DMs, Flood please, because that was the stupidest. <laughs> I can't say that because I heard some very stupid stuff, and I still will continue to hear it. If you guys don't already follow me on Instagram, number one, follow right. me on Instagram at the Common Hype and on Twitter there's at the Common Hype. Plug. No, I need the shameless plug. All right, you know, plug me while we're here it, at the Trill Sanchez. <laughs> you know, if you guys like. If you DM me, just like just email or something. But I like it's it's so 99 requests. I don't even think he replies to my DMs on that page. I don't. He works 25 8. If you guys don't know, <laughs> he'll be in the office working 25 8, typing his life away. So if you guys need him, he'll be. He aware. works harder than our website. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Caught it a little late, but it was still fun. If you guys are still watching the video at this point, uh, please send us in the DMs. Just make up a make up a T-shirt design for us. Make up a hat design for us that you want to see. We're, Maybe we're, send us some clothes. I need some new clothes in the yeah, wardrobe. You want a jewelry we'll company? Send yeah. us some jewelry. You want us a clothing company? Send us some clothing. We'll rock it. We'll show you guys. Uh, no, let me rephrase that. We might rock it. Yeah. Send it to us beforehand so we can take a look at it, and then we'll tell you if we're rocking or not. And shout out your company. Yeah, you guys know the style. You guys see Bryce style. You see my style. I mean, I don't really wear anything crazy. Drew Brandon, needs shorts down to his knees. Brandon doesn't wear anything crazy either. So it's like Brandon's fit today was pretty valid. I gave it to him. All right. Hyper Royals. Mine? EE shorts. All right. F and T. Thought mine was kind of valid. It's all right though. I didn't. I didn't say yours wasn't. Oh. I just. All right. There it is. You know, you step out all the time, Drew. Yeah. When Brandon need, steps out, it's We need to get Tommy some new drip, I think. I think I need way more drip, bro. Tommy don't care though. Tommy's, Tommy's about his money. Yeah. He gets his money up, none his funny up. Yeah. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. I don't I wish I could show you guys more of this because it's like you guys saw the behind the scenes in San Diego. That would like actually happen. You guys love the behind the scenes though. You you just you yearn for it for it. But I'm telling you right now, if I wake up to a camera in my face in the new house. I will fade every YouTube subscriber that allows it to happen, and I will fade Bryson for letting it happen, and then this idiot, just because he's an idiot. We are going to have so much fun in this house, and not only that, we're going to be we're going to be networking 24/7 in that house. Really? And we have a special visitor coming at the end of the month. Wow! Stay tuned. Stay not tuned. saying his name. Yeah, yeah. A special guest staying with us in the new house. I don't know. Could be kind of fun. You'll see us networking. A God light. damn it! That means we have to go out. Ladies, though, if you want to come through, yeah, you know, for Bertura, because I'm I'm wife. DM me, DM me for the Addy. I'll bring, I'll text you. I'll text. DM you. <laughs> WhatsApp you. Maybe kick. I'm on kick these days. <laughs> it's that bad, huh? Yeah, it's, it's really getting bad. I'm not on Tinder, Bumble, Hinge, Christian Mingle. Guys, that's gonna conclude today's video. We appreciate all of you guys tuning in. Oh wait, maybe not. Maybe more. You selling? Yeah. Cool. You cool being on camera? Cool. All right, let's just do one more quick deal before we close the video out, boys. All right, maybe not. We got some How's customers. How's it going, guys? Uh, How's it going? We got a pair of 450s in a size five and a half. We got a pair of 700s, size nine men. A six, another pair of the cream. How much were you looking for, bro? For the size six, I was looking for 350. Size nine, I was looking like can you be at 325 on the size 6? Can you do 335? I can meet you at 330. Alright. I can be at 3 on the size 9. Can you do 310? I'd be at 3. What was your price on that? Uh, 270. Can you do 260? Sure. 890 for the 3. Alright. Can you do just 9 even? Um. Yeah, that's fine. Hi, Bo.
Hi guys. Okay, now we're closing out today's video. We appreciate all of you guys tuning in and watching. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you leave a like on this video. Comment down below because we respond yeah, to every single comment. And $25 going appreciate out to a random commenter in this video. Don't forget to so make sure you guys comment down below and get a response from yours truly, the man behind the camera, Drew, or Brandon over there closing the deal. And make sure, of course, you guys are subscribed on the road to 100K. Gonna aim to shoot for 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And we can't do it without you guys, so make sure you guys know. Also mentioned in this video, we have our merch coming. We have more hats on the way already. Um, two new colorways are already in route. And then, of course, the clothing that we showed you guys. And we have some more clothing designs that we haven't released. But if you guys have any designs, you guys have any ideas, drop them down in the comments. Create a design for us. Send it to our email. If we use it, we'll obviously hook you up with the tea, throw you some money too. So we want everyone to win, everyone to eat, and of course to provide you guys with some stuff that you would wear and that we would wear as well. So that's gonna close it for today's video. We appreciate you guys tuning in and we'll see you in the next one. Sprice from Common Hype and we're out.